So cool, too smooth, a man, calm and collected and respected, injected with such a love it infected my midsection with butterflies eluding confidence as a fence like a wall built with bricks, unconditional love, it exists and it insists on the knowledge of its presence. You will know I love you with evidence, proof that aloof was never the case. The division of a fence between you and my mother's place, but in regards to me and my brother, that fence was erased. The embrace of a father is by far the best cradle, most stable. It enables your pride. This is I. Because of you, because of life, and after death, I still praise you. Like my father that made you. Like those prayers that saved you and bought us time, extra time. That seemed so fundamental, I didn't think it was so essential. I thought we'd have more time down the line. You never lashed me and never bashed me when my potential was compromised by bad decisions and I apologize for not progressing within that time to show you me before you died. You'd be with me, elderly and sickly, and then I could be your lullaby, sing you songs of thank yous all the time to reassure you of a job well done before you lied or before you were laid within that grave that has now grown grass as if a hole was never made or never dug a forever love I will display. Unselfishly, I will speak of you highly every day, hoping it reaches you in such a way that you open the clouds to release a sun ray. And I pray that I interpret it as though you were trying to say, I hear you, baby. I know it, baby. Don't worry, baby. We okay.